Oh my God, it's f***ing hot as f*** right now. Well, actually, I'm at the coast, so it's not as hot, but inland, it is f***ing hot. It is mother f***ing blazing hot. It's 100 degrees where I live. F***ing insane, so... <gasps> What's well, good, my beautiful dingleberries? Today, I am out here at the coast getting ready to do some motherfucking rock fishing. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> what the f***? Um, and uh, I've lost my train of thought. Whoa. I'm sorry, y'all. It's just the goddamn heat. It's driving me nuts. <laughs> but uh, it's 4 p.m. And uh, today I'm going to be launching out of a different spot uh, than I normally do when I, when I, when I, when I jump on a penis and fly away. What? I'm launching out of a different spot today and I really have no idea what to expect, but I'm hoping that the bite's going to be good and uh, yeah, don't have much to say. So without further ado, I'm uh, unstrap my kayak, grab all my fishing gear and tackle and head out onto the water. So I see you beautiful dingleberries in a second. Well, folks, I'm pedaling to my first spot right now. And uh, there are a bunch of sea lions just making a bunch of oi 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 sounds. <laughs> and uh, it smells like f***ing ass out here. It smells like absolute f***ing ass. Like the inside of an elephant's asshole. Don't ask me how I know. I just know. Okay? It f***ing stinks. It f***ing literally stinks. Oh my god. I like uh, my other spot a lot better than this one. This one is... Definitely more public, more well known. Um, for those y'all who live in this area, y'all definitely know where this spot is. It is a no-brainer where I'm at right now. And um, yeah, it's gonna take me probably like 10 minutes to get to my first spot. Got some pedaling to do. I talked to a fellow fisherman uh, as he was getting ready to leave. And uh, he told me to uh, stay close to the kelp beds. Don't wander off too far. Because the further out I go, there aren't any reefs, so I gotta stay closer to shore. Hopefully I can catch some solid rockfish today. I don't think I'm gonna be able to catch a big lingcod, not at this spot anyways. But, uh, hey, I'm gonna remain optimistic and, uh, you know, we'll see what happens. Okay, folks, I've pulled up to my first spot and I'm about to make my first cast of the day. And uh, if you look straight ahead of me, there's a ton of seagulls because they all want the fish that the sea lion has in his mouth. I don't know if y'all can see. Uh, but yeah, he's he's thrashing around right now and because uh, he's got a big ass fish in his mouth. It looked orange, so it's probably like a cannery or uh, maybe a copper rockfish. <laughs> Damn, look at that. These seagulls are going crazy right now like gimme give gimme give gimme give gimme they're like fucking hoarders man they're like oh i want that shit too give me that give me that good me that good good oh and also i've got a new reel the cast king speed demon pro which is a lot better than the regular speed demon reel so uh yeah i shouldn't have any problems with this reel Look at this shit. It's a plastic glove. Right here, right in front of me. Look at that. Oh. There, this is ridiculous. People who just leave their garbage here, or throw their garbage and litter. It's just fing disgusting. Like, if you throw your garbage on the streets and shit, you're, you're a piece of fing shit. Like, what the fuck? Seriously? A glove? Oh, and then look at that. There's another piece of plastic right here. Like, whoop de doo, there's more waste. It's like we need more waste, am I right? Just need more waste. That's all we need. More waste, less fish. <sighs> Ridiculous. People are just disgusting. Sometimes, sometimes I really wonder why people, why do people do this type of shit? I don't know. Look at that. That's a piece of plastic right there. That's a piece of fucking plastic, which, you know, should not be in the ocean. Ridiculous. 
absolutely ridiculous. I'm gonna throw that in the garbage where it belongs when I get back to the launch ramp. Ooh, got a bite. fish. Oh, there's a fish. Yep, hooked up. Yes. <laughs> yeah, baby. Finally, first fish of the day. <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, he's fighting. He's fighting now. <laughs> what is it? It is. Oh, chill out, buddy. Chill out. It is a. What is this? A yellowtail or a black rockfish? I uh, still don't really know my uh, rockfish species. Don't know much about them. But nevertheless, it is a solid chunky monkey. Up, oh, my line's tangled. God damn it! <laughs> but finally, I've caught my first fish of the day. Awesome, awesome, awesome. I've been fishing for about like an hour and a half. With no luck, finally caught my first fish of the day. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about, baby. Yeah. Let's see. Where did I hook you? Oh, I uh, cannot see you with all this kelp. Let's get this out of the way. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, it's already, you're unhooked already. Wow. All right. I guess I didn't hook you very well, but I still got gotcha. you. <laughs> Come on, open your mouth. Oh, 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 stop it, man. Stop it. Uh, chill out there, buddy. Chill out. There we go, son. There we go. First rockfish of the day. Yes, sir. All right, buddy. Thank you so much for biting. Deuces. Oh, there's a fish. Oh, shit. <laughs> I was snagged for a minute, and now I got a fish on. Oh, damn. <laughs> Ooh. Sick fish, baby. It is a, ooh, it's a solid olive rockfish. Look at that. I've never caught one of these guys before. <laughs> this is the first olive rockfish that I've ever caught. Nice, nice. Oh, 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 chill, chill, chill out, buddy. I know you're mad, but uh, don't worry. I'm not going to eat you. I'm going to throw you back into the ocean in a minute, or not in a minute, in like 10, 20 seconds after I take a picture of you. <laughs> okay, buddy, back into the water you go. See ya. Woo. There we go, there we go, there's a fish, yes! <laughs> oh yeah! I was letting out some line and then uh, all of a sudden, I uh, felt some weight at the end of my line and then I uh, set the hook and there is a fish. <laughs> yeah! Woo! Wonder what species of rockfish this guy is. It is. Ooh, it's a black rockfish. I think it's a. This is a black rockfish. That's a solid one too. Look at that. Damn. It is a solid fish. Now do me a favor, buddy. Don't thrash too much. All right. All right. There we go. You're a good boy. Unlike some of your other friends. Some of your other friends are holes. They be. Maybe, uh, oh, 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 now you want to be a prick too. Okay. Ah, oh, God. 
hate it when y'all thrash around like crazy, get water all into my face and mouth and shit. <laughs> but hey, third fish of the day. Awesome. All right, buddy. Thank you for coming out to play. See ya. Okay, folks, I've been fishing for about three hours now. And so far, I've had a pretty decent day of fishing. I've caught two solid rockfish and I caught my first olive rockfish ever. So I think it's safe to say that I'm pretty content with how my day's been going so far. And uh, the time right now is 7.15, so I got about an hour left to fish. And with that being said, I'm gonna put the camera back on the chesty and continue fishing. And hopefully, I'll catch a solid cabazon or lingcod. Oh, damn, there was a fish on. Hit it as I was reeling in the lure. Damn it. Oh. That means they're not at the bottom, or at least some of these guys aren't at the bottom. Some of these guys are in the mid-water column. Holy sh! that was a squid. That was an octopus right there. Oh, I hooked up on an octopus. I don't know if he's alive or not, but that was an octopus. <laughs> wow, a little baby octopus. I don't know if y'all saw that, but that was definitely an octopus. Octopus, puss, puss, pussy, pussy, puss. There we go, yes. Oh no, that's a snag. Uh, there we go, unhooked. Oh wait, there's a fish on. <laughs> oh sh I did not expect that. <laughs> oh yeah, baby, come in here. Come in here, come to daddy. Come to daddy, come on, come on. Oh, he's actually fighting pretty good. Come on, not losing this one. Definitely not losing this one. Might actually be a cabazon. Let's see what he is. What you be, what you be? Oh, you are a copper rockfish, I think. Yes, you are. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, that is a pretty rockfish. Look at that, folks. Another rockfish. Solid one, definitely. Let's get this hook out of you. Oh, there we go. There we go, there we go. Another fish, baby. Y'all, y'all, y'all. All right, buddy. Deuces. Oh, shit. you good there, man? Need some help? I got you. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, nope. He doesn't need my help. He's gone. <laughs> There's a fish. There we go. Yep. Oh, yeah. Fifth fish of the day. <laughs> Come in here, bubber. Come to daddy. Come on. Come to pat pat. Come on, baby. I gotcha. I'm not going to lose you. You are a... Oh, it's another... Uh, another copper. You are a copper rockfish. A beautiful one too. These guys are definitely one of the prettier rock fishes. There we go. Fifth fish, fifth fish, fifth fish. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, let's get this hook out without poking out your eyeballs. Your eyeball. Oh my. God damn it. Ugh. There we go. Unhooked, baby. Y'all. Whew. Pretty, pretty fish. Alrighty, buddy. See ya. Oop. There's a bite. Come on. Take it. There we go. 
Oh, damn it. There we go. Yes. <laughs> Missed him the first time, got him the second time. Yeah. I'm in here, baby. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a uh, copper. Woo! That's a pretty little rock fish. Yeah. Solid sixth fish of the day. And I think we're going to wrap it up here. It is starting to get dark, and I want to be back at the launch ramp before it's completely pitch black. All right, buddy. Deuces. Alrighty, folks, it is officially the following day of the fun rock fishing trip. For the first hour and a half or so that I was out there, I struggled to get a bite because I was unfamiliar with the territory and I was fishing at the wrong spot. I chose to fish away from the kelp beds in deeper water. And the reason why I chose to do that was because I saw a big sea lion with a big rockfish in his mouth and there were a bunch of seagulls surrounding him trying to get a piece of that rockfish. So I thought, oh, the rockfish must be in deeper water. But after quite a few casts with no luck, I realized that the fish were not in deeper waters. So I moved up to the kelp beds and that's when I started catching some fish. And uh, overall, I had a blast out there. The weather was perfect. It was only 78 degrees with a slight breeze, which felt really nice. So uh, yeah, yesterday was a nice day to be out on the water. And uh, before I sign out, there's one more thing that I wanna talk to you all about, which is the littering problem. So while I was out fishing yesterday, I saw some plastic floating on the surface of the water. And as y'all saw in the video, I picked it up without a second thought. And it really just pisses me off to see plastic at the ocean, at the lakes, at the delta, at the creeks, at the ponds, at the beaches. There's plastic everywhere. And that really makes me mad. I mean, it's 2019 and people are still littering. And I don't know why. I don't get it. It is a known fact that littering is terrible for the environment, but people don't care. And that just makes my blood boil. Honestly, folks, if we don't do anything about this plastic problem, then in a few decades, there will be a lot more plastic than fish. And the future generations will not be able to enjoy this recreational sport. So for those of y'all who enjoy fishing and are on the YouTube platform, I highly encourage y'all to be more vocal about the plastic problem because it is a real problem and we cannot ignore it anymore. So if you guys see plastic lying on the ground or floating on the water, please just pick it up and throw it in a garbage can. And with that being said, it's time for me to sign out now. So if you guys like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to hit the big red subscribe button if you haven't already. And turn on your notifications so that you'll always be notified every time I drop a new video. Peace out, my beautiful dingleberries.